gold medal final. This one, 110 kilos, 242 pounds. Yeah, this uh, weight class was the most competitive, I believe, in the tournament. Uh, all four of the seeded athletes were very, very good. Uh, Guy Barahoma, and it was also a seed. He got defeated in the semis, as did uh, Brian Keck, who uh, obviously had a wonderful wrestling career in both freestyle and Greco, and is now an instructor down here at American, I mean, at Extreme Couture. Uh, but these two guys have represented the United States at the world level. Both have won medals. Kelly's won a world title. Uh, this is this is the best of the best right here. And uh, they're battling out a spot to see who represent the United States at the world championships. Oh, yeah, no, they have a lot of respect for each other and certainly for the sport of grappling. And, you know, Kelly's... Uh, Kelly's looked pretty good in his competition so far, as have Four Brandon. Minutes. They both had to have two victories to earn a spot in this final match. Well, you know, Justin's wrestling today. He's over in, uh, right now uh, competing in, in Poland at the Pitlazinski tournament. So both Ruiz brothers are on the mat. Uh, Brand obviously, Justin is trying to make the Olympic team. Uh, he's going to go to the World Championships for us in, in Greco-Roman wrestling. And then it's possible that uh, his brother Brandon, if, with a victory here, will be representing the United States over in Serbia. At 34 years old. Yeah. Um, you know, he's been doing lots of these different styles of, of martial arts. But besides doing the feel of grappling, he in, enters Pancrase, all kinds of different tournaments. Kelly, Kelly Anenson is an MMA fighter. He's uh, with American Top Team, and he says he's going to be competing overseas, I think, um, in Asia for his next professional fight. So, three just minutes. We're at today, and on the weekend, it was just a host of huge pancreation event, very successful. Just great them having many more of those, as well as these. I really like the turnout so far. Well, uh, USA Grappling's pleased with the quality of the competition here today and the wonderful host uh, situation we have with Extreme Couture. And uh, we've seen some outstanding competitors uh, battling for uh, spots on the U.S. team. No score yet, no takedown, and they've not gotten it into any of the, the, the mat wrestling positions of yet. By the way, new gear available at Extreme Couture. Randy's wearing Single leg takedown, Kelly Anenson. Did you like that takedown, Scott? Point one for the United States, uh, Kelly Anenson. He's uh, with American Top Team. Uh, yep, now he's uh, both of these guys are uh, world medal challengers if they make the U.S. team. So. Right, on a takedown for Kelly Anenson about halfway through the period. Now, we'll see whether they get back to their feet or whether Kelly's going to keep the mat wrestling going on. Brandon's trying to get out there and back to his feet, and I think he's mostly able to do that. Kelly does a front headlock. Did a good job establishing the base, pushing up and out, separating the two. Oh, there's a point. We have one to one. We're tied up. So that's basically an escape point. And it's funny. Or in, in wrestling would be called an escape point. Right about a minute and a half. One to one. The scoreboard says one to one. The coaches are asking. <laughs> Kelly Anenson, takedown out of bounds. No. He gets left in the water. The coaches are arguing. Kelly again on a leg attack. Double leg push out. If that was freestyler Greco, you'd get a point on that. But grappling, you have to complete the, complete the move. This is a very competitive match. Louise with the leg takedown. One 
point, Brandon Ruiz leads two to one. Wow, and it looked like Kelly almost was going to uh, get a point on a takedown on the edge. They went out of bounds. In this case, uh, Brandon Ruiz got the takedown, a leg attack, which is interesting because he used to wrestle Greco, and he's leading now two to one. Very aggressive. And out of nowhere, here comes the lead. It just shows you, do not stop wrestling. Don't give up. Yeah, no, I, and certainly Ruiz getting a point from the bottom to tie it and then getting the takedown to get the lead. Kelly trying to get up to his feet. 4 points. Wow. 6-1 is four now. So Brandon Ruiz, uh, very successful in this uh, late part of this match. Gets a takedown and then sc scores from the mat, a 4-point score. And he's going to end up being the World Team Trials champion. Unless Kelly's able to do some kind of submission in the next few seconds. Time is out. Brandon Ruiz. Looks like he's in the 242 pound first place match for the gold medal. Brandon Ruiz represents is victorious. Brandon Ruiz. Next up on bat number one. 